Hi, everybody. I'm back. <laughs> and I have got a really pretty, pretty journal. I just love this yarn. It's so pretty. I don't need that, though. And it's, it's tied with some cotton uh, fabric. And just the fuzzies. I just let the fuzzies do their fuzzy thing. And it measures eight by five. I'm on eight by five kick today. I put a big, huge doily, two of them actually, just two different ones, one in the back and then one at the bottom, and then I took another doily part laid over it and put some seam binding and a real pretty flower with some pearls in it. And the spun and a fuzzy, don't need that, in the back, and I did the tie to match goes together nicely. It's stitched in a light uh, beige. And got the matching pocket here and some cards. This is part of a tablecloth back here and it's a, got a pale pattern on it. Damaged. Well, not a pale, a shiny actually. A little card here with some washi tape. And this is, uh, I used another kit I got from Screech Owl. I just love her stuff. It's so pretty. Did a little stitching there. So it shows through on the other side with a big card here and some fabrics and laces. Just real pretty soft images. This has got a little, it's got a music theme to it. And there's a piano and then a did kind of a drape with the seam binding and put different pieces of doily in it. On it. In it. <laughs> on it. I'm stitching going down this side. And it shows through on this side. And then a little mini pocket here. And I put some lace and part of a doily. And this has got uh, music notes for the background and different uh, laces and um, part of a doily here with a little tag. It says postcard on it. And then two little cards. No, well, not two little cards. Two cards. Get in there. It'd fit really good in there if it wasn't for my family fingers. Look at that teeny tiny pearl. Cute. Another part with lined, and it's on a real grungy piece of coffee dyed paper. And all the edges are inked and roughed up and stitched in a, in a, uh, is that green or brown? Brown. Ooh, my eyeballs. Got a belly band here with the matching fabric. Nice little pretty image and I put just a piece of a doily on the little stopper that holds this card in place so it doesn't fall through. Little flower that's a tuck spot that I will, uh, that I didn't stuff. Imagine that. I'll get it though. Another card here. Uh, lots of uneven pages, some laces, different laces there. Another piano image with some lace and stitching from the other side. Some uh, crumpled up seam binding and a little flower. A tuck spot here with a postcard. That neat how that does. That, you know, it comes up over. Love that. And more pretty stitching. And here is a lace pocket with an image of a violin and. Um, some leaves and stuff on it and then a little image up there some stitching and look at that coffee staining it's so funny you can get this and this in the same batch isn't that hysterical you just don't know what's going to happen a little card with some really pretty font lots of stitching Stitching up there. Love that. 
I think that's my favorite stitch. It just to me is so pretty. So you got a lot of places to write in this journal and lots of pretties. Some crumpled up uh, seam binding there. I like that look. It's just bunched. I think it's cool. A little piece of lace and stitching all around the page there. A little flower. Over here's a tuck spot, lady with a harp. I don't think I showed that on the cover. Well, I'll do that before I move on to the next one. Is that a mandolin? I think that's a mandolin. Some uh, linen ruffle with some part of a doily. Sheet of music line, music paper. Just a little, another pocket with uh, the music paper and a banjo. Oh, it's Learn Your Instruments Day. Isn't that pretty? How pretty that is. Love that card. Got another collage here, two little mini pages, and some vintage peeps. <laughs> peeps. And uh, seam binding in a rose. And another tuck spot that I will fill in. A little pretty image here. A little tuck spot there with one of our envelopes. Love that. I just love it. And those stamps are real. Inside, and some lined paper, been coffee stained. And pretty Pete, part of a doily there, and the stitching from the other side. And I leave the threads, if it drives you crazy, just snip them off. I always say that. I kind of like them. That pretty yellow bow. I love that. So pretty. This is a cheery book. It's a, it's a soft, cheery book. So far there. And stitching. And some flowers. Over here, I just, see, I love how that sticks up. Love it. This just neat. Um, I use different laces here. Got some blue laces, some cream colored laces, part of a doily hidden up under there, um, part of a doily here in white, and then I used a little mini gold bow. And another card here, and I just, uh, this came with the kit, so I used it and put a lace and a rose up there. And it's got a little mini booklet with the music, which is different uh, types of coffee dyed paper, and I inked around it in gray. And some part of a crochet doily edge and a rose. And some more seam binding and sorry silk, a little image there. Isn't that pretty? Big card there. And for the pocket on the back, got it stuffed with a piece of coffee dyed paper and a little notepad with the crochet doily and the lace and the music. All goes together really nicely. This has got all different kinds of pages to write on. And then that uh, damask like background there, it's really soft. There's the back again. And the front, the pretty lady, she's she's playing the harp. What a pretty, pretty book. And I want to thank you all for being here with me on your Friday and taking some time out to come see me. And I will see you all in the next video.